Good evening, and you're very welcome to Key Moments in French History. Tonight, we're going back to July 1914, when the French Socialist Party, recently reunited, had just won a victory in the general election. President Poincaré, President Poincaré was accused of being more Russian than the Russians by Foreign Minister Jean Jaurès. Then in mid-July he went to Germany to do a deal with the German socialist leader and to try and create strikes and to stop tensions brewing in the Alsace conflict which he had worked for the past two years to uh, stop a mobilization. There was a real fear at the time that Russia would mobilize and there was a real fear that saber rattling by saber rattling by King George, Kaiser Wilhelm II and Alexander of Hesse's husband Nicholas II who were all first cousins was going to, to, to spread like cancer to Pongar also in the, in the French government towards what was called a triple entente between Britain, France and Russia. It was feared in late July that Russia was about to mobilise causing huge tensions on the French Eastern Front with Germany and Due to these alliances, this series of of uh, of of uh, subtle alliances, subliminal alliances. At that time, Jean Jaurès made an appeal on the thirty first of July, to nineteen fourteen, and said, in the Assembly Nationale at two o'clock in the afternoon, "Escan a ora avoir, escan on va avoir." Ungere Mondia. Est-ce qu'on va, est-ce que, on va avoir un guerre mondia? He was desperate, désespérant. Are we going to have a world war? He was the man to coin the phrase world war. Are we going, to, is this what you want? He said to Paul Guerra's men. Are we going to have a world war? He was eating his dinner in Montmartre at 10 o'clock that evening and he was shot dead with two bullets by a man called Raoul Villain who was a terrorist member of a group called the Friends of Alsace who was against the policy that Jean Jaurès had worked for years to stop a revanche war between France towards Germany for the Alsace territory. And in in effect he gave his life for his anti militarism and on the second of August nineteen fourteen France entered the Great War. So if somebody talks to you about Jean Jor Remember that quote, are we going to have a world war? He knew that he was sacrificing his life, but he gave his life so that there would not be a war between France and Germany. Despite the fact that um, uh, Kaiser Wilhelm II, who was from Schleswig Holstein, had been building up the navy and the U-boats for years and the British had been involved in an arms race with him building up the dreadnoughts. This meant the only thing certain though if this if this pro-militarism was encountered by John George's anti-militarism it meant that there was going to be a world war and most of it would probably be fought in French and France and Belgium at the expense of French and Belgian people. 
their, their, their homelands and their men. And that's exactly what happened. He was a neo-Marxist, so he was against the dictatorship of the proletariat, but he was for uh, the, hip, the, 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 the synthesis with the Hegelian dialectic, which says that what does it profit a working class French soldier, a farm labourer, a mechanic, to shoot lead into a German or, or a Britisher, a British mechanic or a German mechanic or farm labourer to shoot lead into a French or British mechanic or farm labourer. That it's one class killing each other on behalf of the one class in Britain, what was known as lions led by donkeys. The British army were lions, the working class members, soldiers led by donkeys. The um, as, as a historian, um, what's it called? Gary Sheffield says, the, for, uh, the forgotten victory in, in the battle of so, the that, um, that the, arist the aristocracy, the entitled officer, officer, officer uh, were actually um, very, very badly trained and had no courage. They were, they were an embarrassment to the people they were superior to. So, I hope you've enjoyed tonight's key moments in French history. Join me again for another version of key moments in French history from Bali Denmark. Thank you very much.